So we all know that Takashi 6 ix 9 has been finishing the remainder of his prison sentence on house arrest during this global pandemic. He's quarantining just like the rest of us, except now he's gotta move. 6 ix 9 has relocated since his address was leaked, but thanks to a kind neighbor who spotted him on the patio, we now know he was living in this Lido Beach home in New York. So I'm in my fucking room. 6 ix 9 is literally, he moved into the house behind me, he's taking pictures to, on the back deck. In this video, we'll look at where Takashi 6 9 has been calling home, or what we know about all that anyways. Daniel Hernandez, known as 6 9 or Takashi 6 9 is a rapper, songwriter, and as Wikipedia basically says, convict. It seems no matter what the rapper does, good or bad, the public goes crazy for it, and that attention is one of the reasons why he's finding it so hard to keep his addresses on the down low. 6 9s persona is controversial, known for his rainbow-colored hair, extensive tattoos, including the ones on his face, public feuds with fellow celebs, and legal issues. Not to mention his aggressive style of rapping. I'm sure I'm not alone when I say I get a little scared certain times his verses come on. 6 9 received a two year prison sentence last year after testifying for the prosecution. In the midst of this pandemic, in April 2020, he was granted early release due to fears of being vulnerable to the disease. Apparently, he has asthma. Anyways, he was put on house arrest for the remainder of his term, and we all know he's moving homes again because everyone found out his address. And 6 9 address isn't the only thing that went viral. He was given permission to make music while on house arrest and it was thought he filmed his music video for Gooba inside the Lido Beach home. His new single released last week actually broke YouTube's record for most watched hip hop video in 24 hours. Currently it's at like 94 million views and keeps climbing as we speak. It's unknown what Takashi's net worth is but it's estimated at around 5 mil. Despite his money, he hasn't found a permanent place to really call home yet. Hey guys, it's Kara and today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. We're going to be looking at the home that 6 9 was holed up in for his house arrest so far in Lido Beach, and we may even know the new house he's moved to in Watermill, but I'll get to that in just a bit. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post so you can always be up to date. We've also done house tours in the likes of Travis Scott and Eminem, and we'll link to some at the end. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and as usual, let me know whose house tour is next in those comments down below. Now let's get into this video. <laughs> And we body this. Quit playing. Y'all already know how we're coming. Yeah. <laughs> So I guess it was too hard for 6 9 to keep up his hideout home a secret for long, especially once he started parading his signature rainbow hair out on the patio for photo shoots. We can tell the neighbor who exposed him out there was right because he even put the pic from his balcony on his Instagram. Now that the rapper's address has been leaked, he had to quickly move. 6 9 attorney Lance Lazaro said in a statement that his client has been relocated due to safety reasons and the feds have been made aware of the move. The rapper didn't violate his house arrest regulations, but had to make the move due to his neighbor's posting his location on social media. Like I said, there's already a possible new address for 6 9 and it hasn't even been a week. Anyways, the home we know for a fact 6 9 was spending his house arrest and quarantine was a rental located in Lido Beach, New York, which by the sounds of it is a quieter neighborhood on Long Island. According to real estate sources, the home would have cost our boy over 4k per month to rent and the market price is valued at just over 1 million. 6 9s house was a single family home spanning 1,878 square feet of space situated on a 6,500 square foot lot. The house itself was built in 1971 and has been renovated plenty since. There were 4 beds and 3.5 baths according to the listing. The home is described as having an open floor plan which we can see from the common living spaces like the living and dining areas. There's also a spacious kitchen in this part of the home too. There's a lot of natural light and bright white walls in here giving the home a beach house vibe. Not to mention there are floor to ceiling glass doors leading out to the patio and backyard. There's also an additional den and family room and floors in this house are a mix of hardwood and tile. There's space to park one or two cars in the garage and then additional space on the driveway. 6 ix previous home was also just steps away from the beach according to the listing but I guess that was of no use to him considering he was on house arrest. He was able to take advantage of the large backyard with barbecue and patio as well as a spacious second floor balcony which he was caught posing out on. There is also a heated in ground pool out back but I don't think the weather warmed up enough for that. Like I said, it's thought that they filmed the music video for Gooba inside this home. I'm not quite sure where because they completely transformed the look of it thanks to editing but what room do you guys think 6 9 did this in? I mean he had to fit all those girls in there too. Watching the vid it does doesn't really look like 6 9 is practicing safe social distancing, but hey, I won't snitch. Good. 
This ain't no situation, bro. Larry, look at that. Look at that. Jeez. Copy. Copy. 6 9 who? Dude, there's some guy in that red car. Alright, let's get out. <laughs> Now that 6ix9ine had to evacuate his Lido beach house, there are already rumors online that fans figured out his new address too. Dirt. Dirt. That's that crib. And that. According to some Instagram posts, it's reported the rapper has moved to the area of Water Mills, New York to finish his quarantine and home confinement. Drove by this house like 10 times. George, Pierce, slow down. Pierce, slow down. Hold on, I'll go over there. Go He's moving. He's moving, Bubby. Go back. He's moving. Pierce, slow down. Dude, I've drove by this house like 10 times. George, Pierce. Some short video clips surfaced of this mansion and the cars on the driveway, which led fans to believe this is where 6ix9ine is moved. Some are saying it's fake news and we don't have much proof, but it's definitely very possible. If 6 9 did move to this mansion, it's one hell of an upgrade to say the least. According to the listing, this place would cost about 60 k per month to rent and is valued over $4.7 The lot is over an acre and inside, the home spans over 8,000 square feet of living space. Located in Watermill, New York, this home is within the town of Southampton on Long Island in the elite vacation area of the Hamptons. Custom built in 2005, this home is described as an entertainer's paradise, and although it's listed as a summer home, I'm sure 6ix9ine would have no problem living here full time as the place is gorgeous. There are 7 beds and 8 baths and 5 fireplaces spread over 3 stories. Every inch of the home has been designed with perfect details and craftsmanship and combines modern upgrades with old world charm. There are cathedral ceilings, wood flooring, and even ocean views. The main floor offers a sun-drenched great room with double height vaulted ceilings, the four Formal dining room with space for over a dozen guests, den, powder room, and the eating kitchen with marble countertops and state-of-the-art appliances. The master suite is on the main floor as well and has its own fireplace, large attached bath, walk-in closet, as well as walk-out French doors opening up to the pool. Moving to the second story of the home, each of the spacious bedrooms have their own ensuite bathrooms too. The walk-out lower level of this place looks like the coolest area of the mansion as well, made with reclaimed barnwood and exposed brick. Here there's a cozy gathering room or den, a full private bar, a cigar bar, wine cellar, billiards room, home movie theater, half bathroom, and ensuite guest bedroom. If that's not enough, there's also a sauna with separate shower and change rooms and even seating from Al Capone's old Chicago house. Finally, outside of the home is equally impressive. The property overlooks an equestrian farm and even far away ocean views and the whole lot is fitted with lush landscaping. Features on the grounds include a heated 60 foot freeform pool, spa with waterfall, bluestone patio, tennis court, basketball court, outdoor shower, and barbecue grill. Also offered on the property is a separate apartment. Of course, the fancy home is fully gated as well with all the security one would need. If 6 9 is living here, at least he'll be a little bit better protected from fans and paparazzi. Now, this Hamptons mansion is seriously impressive and we know 6 9 is making money like he made clear in his live stream. But this place may be a stretch for him especially to move in so quickly. Does he actually live here? I'll let you guys tell me what you think in the comments. Alright, so that's all I got on 6 9s current living situation. Unfortunately, he probably has to keep whichever spot he's moved to super private, so we don't know for sure if that last mansion we looked at is even where he's living. Any of these properties are definitely quite the step up from the prison cell he would have been calling home, so the rapper is pretty blessed to finish his sentence like this. Anyways, let me know if you guys have any other updates on where 6 9 is moving to or his new place. What did you guys think of these homes in Long Island? Let me know in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat more and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!